going to show you some Led Zeppelin. Cheers! I'm going to continue my unboxing videos about the Jimmy Page remasters. This time I'm going to show you physical graffiti originally released in 1975 so this is sort of a 14th anniversary edition and uh, my copy is uh, the deluxe edition on three 180 gram LPs uh, first two LPs are the original album and the third LP includes unreleased studio outtakes remastered and produced by Jimmy Page himself. So I have already opened this so this is not a real unboxing video. So let's see what's inside. Uh, there was this track list on the original shrink wrap which I have already cut off and uh, <clears throat> even though this is not uh, even though this is a triple LP it's not any kind of uh, gatefold so I have put these LPs in the protective sleeve uh, behind the album itself and the back cover looks like this but let's see the LPs first uh, I have replaced the original inner sleeves with this kind of uh, black polylined inner sleeves and uh, label looks like this cool swan song label and uh, the others are exactly the same and the third LP it says here that the companion disc but the uh, famous uh, physical graffiti cut out uh, sleeve is very very cool and that's one of the reasons I wanted to replace the original inner sleeves and uh, it would have become too tight if I had put them all the LPs inside this with the new inner sleeves and uh, you know the the deal. It's it's like this. The windows are open, and uh, it came with this kind of. Where's the track listing and stuff like that? Some uh, credits and everything. I suppose. There was this kind of uh, in the original original version as well, but here's here's the original uh, inner sleeves which came with this, and here's the companion companion disc. So you must have seen this hundreds of times already but uh, I still want to show it because it's so damn damn cool so the people the characters change in the windows when you when you change this inner sleeve like this
So I think that this is one of the coolest album covers ever. And uh, this cost pretty much. Uh, I was thinking, should I get uh, try to get the original pressing because I could find it for almost the same amount of money that I spent on this. But uh, I thought that uh, maybe I I will buy this and. Uh, try to find the, some early pressings uh, of this maybe later and uh, I have bought already all the deluxe vinyl versions from these recent Jimmy Page uh, remasters so I couldn't stop here uh, maybe if I bought them now, I would just bought the deluxe edition from the first one because there's very cool live album with previously unreleased material and just get the ordinary vinyl versions from all the other remasters and maybe buy the deluxe versions with companion audio on CD when they become a little cheaper so that's that's my opinion on this and uh, I would like to hear you your thoughts about these remasters which versions have you bought and why or uh, why you haven't bought them at all or I would really like to hear your opinions about this. I have listened to that physical graffiti only a uh, couple of times now from this remastered version and uh, I didn't have this on vinyl at all before this so I can't compare it sound wise but uh, to my ears this sounds Sounds very good. And uh, what can I say about the album? Uh, maybe not the best Led Zeppelin album, but without a doubt, uh, their most ambitious work. Uh, double album with uh, different kinds of songs, and of course, there's Probably my favorite Led Zeppelin song ever, Kashmir, and uh, many many other good songs as well. But uh, maybe not the best best album, like I said, but uh, very very good and uh, very ambitious work. And uh, I just love this sleeve. I could stare it for hours. So that was my quick unboxing video about the physical graffiti. Uh, please leave a comment. Thanks for watching. Until next time.